Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I am Leroy Truth for Leroy Truth Investigations. And I am coming to you live on my boat. And I've got a big thunderstorm pouring rain behind me here and around me. So then the lighting is not great, but I had to get this Carolina video out. And a number of you have seen the body cam footage and security footage of Carolina being viciously slammed to the pavement by that sadistic piece of garbage who needs to be arrested like this with prejudice. Now watch this video here. And at first it's far away, then I'm gonna give you a close up of it here. So this security footage here, and you see Caroline over there and she's not a threat. She's a little tiny woman. I'm guessing she's 100 pounds. And she's posing no threat. You can see her body language. And suddenly the cop takes her, slams her on the pavement, face first, bam. She's knocked unconscious. And the two female cops are as guilty as she is. Now let's do it slow-mo here. Take a look slow-mo. And she puts her hand behind her there and he takes her arm. She turns around, completely aggressive, completely uncalled for, completely sadistic. Now he twists her around violently and she slams on her face. Now I'm going to do this again. I'm gonna zoom in now. Again, it's very grainy, but get a kind of a sense here. There she is. She is posing no threat. Look at her body language. She's turned away. She's asking questions. And look, goes for her arm. And there we go, slams her, bam. Full force. Not only with gravity, with him bringing the leverage of his power down on the ground. Now I'm gonna do it one more time. And this is gonna be slow-mo close up. And he's giving her unlawful directives. Why isn't this guy in jail with no bond? No bail at this point. Given her unlawful directives, go over there. We're conducting an investigation. Well, the last I heard, they were towing cars. And she is plenty of room away. Remember, the female officers were in front of her walking away. They didn't care about her. They didn't tell her to leave. This cop here comes in. Oh, I'm going to impress the ladies. Maybe I'll get some tonight. Maybe I'll get with both of them tonight. If I beat the hell out of this little 100-pound, I don't know, 5-foot little woman here. Now, here he goes. Slow-mo here. Takes her arm. And here we go. Violently and viciously slams her face to the pavement. And her life, right there, is changed forever. Sadistic. And those other two cops, they should be arresting that guy. He's not a cop. When, when you violate the American public's rights, you immediately lose your certification, accreditation, everything. You're not a cop any longer, you're a criminal. Those, those women, one of them should have attended to Carolyn and they should have had backup, arrest that cop. Now here's the body cam footage. Look at her, she's a little tiny lady. All right, as far as she knows, there isn't any investigation, and she's not obstructing. She's not obstructing. She's just asking questions. And if they want, they can. He could ignore her, like those two women ignored her. They didn't arrest her. And look how calm that Carolyn is. Carolina is, and he's now he's going to arrest her. And those other two. Police officers should have immediately said, no, you will not arrest her. Otherwise, we will arrest you. And if you continue, we will tase you. And if we continue, we will take your life. Because we are going to protect and serve this innocent woman who is simply asking questions. In public. Stop. Stop. Stop resisting. She's unconscious, agonal breathing she's doing. She's not resisting. She's unfreaking conscious. Listen to the breathing. Don't they have any training? She's agonal.
diagonal breathing and she's bleeding. And those two female officers are letting that piece of garbage, sadistic, violent, evil human arrest her. The worst enemy of a good cop is a bad cop. And the worst enemy of we the people is a good cop. Well, actually, the worst enemy is a bad cop. The next worst enemy is a good cop, supposed good cop, who doesn't stop a bad cop. Therefore, they are not a good cop. They are not being morally righteous. And he's saying, oh, shit. Not because she's unconscious, but because he's probably afraid of what's going to happen to him. But he's probably not afraid of what's going to happen to him because he's protected with qualified immunity. He's not arrested yet. He will. He will. And when people stop saying he's got to be fired only. Of course he's got to get fired. He's got to get arrested. He committed a crime. Carolina, Carolina didn't. I'm Leroy Truth for Leroy Truth Investigations. I'm out. Comment, subscribe to my channel. Thank you.